two goals tonight, especially in the post. I'm just playing the play of the game. Uh, I think we play, you know, a good team basketball game. We play that way. I think everybody can get going. Everybody can, you know, check the floor of the game. And, you know, we have games like we had tonight. Mark, do you think that's the best rhythm you've had in two days? Yeah. For sure. Was there more spacing? I mean, Steve kind of mentioned how the split three on you and rotation something to the space around you. Oh, yeah. I, I think we just did like individually did a better job, you know, uh, kind of getting situations in the game where we kind of on top of each other, and sometimes getting each other's way. So uh, I think the team did a better job. Not I didn't mean individually, but the team did a better job of just you know with, with the space. I think last time you played against the Rockets at home, it seemed like you were getting to your spots and just weren't finishing. Did you feel like you were? Uh, way more comfortable this time around. Yeah, like, I, like you said, um, the rhythm was good for me tonight. Uh, I had my feet underneath me. Yeah, it's a smooth game for me, so I can't complain. In a game like this, whenever they're feeding you and you're, you're doing so well, is, is it a lot of fun for you out there? It's always fun playing good basketball. That's a, I think that's an obvious answer. Yeah. Hey DeMarcus, in the past few days, like Draymond's defended you and Steve and some of the other guys. What's that meant to you overall? Um, I mean, it's cool. Yeah. But we all been in this business long enough to know how it goes. Uh, and I've been around this team, you know, how things go around here. You know. You're always looking for something to make a story <laughs> about. So, I mean, I could care less. I mean, I, I know y'all got to do y'all job and I got to do mine. So, yeah. You know, y'all looking for a story. It is what it is. Oh, it's something every day. It's, <laughs> it's like, uh, you know, my grandmother, when I was younger, she had this uh, show she used to watch. I'm sure y'all heard of it, As the World Turns. <laughs> you know, it was just, she called it her story. I got to watch my story. <laughs> you know, I used to watch it with her, and, you know, every episode, it was something. That's what this is turned into. As the world turns. <laughs> Do you like starring in that, in that no, story? No, I don't. I play basketball. I don't. I don't look for drama or stories or anything like that. I just want to go play basketball. You know, as much as the Rockets switch things, you end up with smaller guys on you in the block a lot. Do you enjoy playing against that uh, that, that style of defense? I don't really care. I don't think anybody can stop me on a run period. So you can put whoever you want on. Me. Honestly. I mean, you've had breakout games before, uh, this season obviously, but most of them have, at least from a scoring standpoint, have been on the road. Is there a comfort level that you have when you do play on the road? I was kind of, I kind of was talking to my, you know, my family about that a little bit. It was like, for some reason I can't just have a good game in Oracle. I don't know what it is, but uh, you know, hopefully it comes to the end quickly. But, uh, you know, I'm sure it'll happen eventually. Um, I think Steve trusted me a little bit more than I stressed tonight, and uh, you know, I'm grateful for that. So, uh, just trying to gain his trust and um, you know, learn how to finish out those situations in, in his eyes. <laughs> That's what I like to do. I, I love to pass. I love to create for others. Um, I think it's something I'm good at. It's one of my strengths. So. Uh, Obviously, it's not the ball is not going to be in my hands the way I'm used to. So, so uh, when I do get the opportunity, I just try to take advantage of it. You said that uh, you know, guys have to adjust from to you from a comfort level because you're an all-star and things like that. But how has the comfort level evolved from from, from your standpoint over the, over the last? I think it's coming. We've had stretches where you know it's kind of fun for everybody, but uh, you know this is a, a team that's been together for a while, and you know they play a certain type of way, and they're used to playing a certain type of way. Me to just come in and you know I'm not expecting it to just this team to adjust to me. Obviously, I have to adjust to them. And, um, you know, I have my opportunities, so all I can do is just try to take advantage of those opportunities. And, um, you know, I think I had those opportunities tonight. And hey, Marcus, what do you think was key in adapting as a team without Kevin on the floor? Um, I mean, you're missing a 25, 30 point game score. Like that's a huge difference. So uh, 
we just got to be more sound. Uh, got to do. We got to be more crisp. Run our offense a lot better. Uh, we don't have a guy that can come in and, and make you know just big shots or superstar shots. Uh, so uh, we just got to be got to be a better team. Was, was that something that you thought of before the game, that knowing that Kevin was out, that you were going to try to go in for scoring? Nah, that's that's not the case. My mindset was just we had to be a, a better team, and uh, I think we did. Thank you, sir. Thank you.